Hey everyone, Dave here. When it comes to USB-C docking stations for your laptops, they can be bulky, take up a lot of desk space, and just not look that great. That is until the new Logidock that looks amazing and has a full built-in speakerphone. With your typical USB-C docking stations, you're probably stuck using your built-in laptop mics, which really doesn't sound very good, and especially the speakers sound pretty bad. Hey, don't take my word for it. Here's music out of the laptop. Logidock. Laptop. Those are both at 80% volume on both the Logidock and the laptop. As you heard for yourself, the sound quality on the Logidock was so much better than the built-in laptop speakers, which isn't overly surprising. There's two 55 millimeter speakers built into the Logidock that gives it a nice bass sound and a full rich sound. And also the volume gets really loud, so it's going to be crystal clear for phone calls and video meetings as well. The Logidock is a USB-C docking station that has a speakerphone built into it, but it's really designed for video meetings on applications like Microsoft Teams, Zoom, and Google Meet, but more on that later. The dock plugs into your computer with the dedicated USB-C to USB-C cable that will also provide 100 watts of charging to your laptop if it supports USB-C charging. On the back, there are eight ports. You have two USB-C, you have two USB-A 3.0 ports, you have an HDMI port, a display port, you also have your dedicated USB-C that connects to your laptop or computer, and you have your plug for your AC power adapter. And speaking of the AC power adapter, that's a whopping power adapter. This is a 230 watt power adapter, but the brick is gigantic that will charge the Logidock. There's also a Bluetooth pairing button on the back of the Logidock that allows you to pair up a smartphone so you can use the Logidock as a Bluetooth speakerphone for your smartphone. And it's simple, you just hold the Bluetooth pairing button for a few seconds to get it into pairing mode, then you'll go on your smartphone to the Bluetooth settings and select the Logidock, and it's that simple. Audio will stream on both your laptop or computer as well as your smartphone at the same time, so you may have to pause audio on one source if you're just trying to listen on one device. Test out the built-in microphone and show you what this webcam is all about. So let's get started right now. I do like that you can answer and end phone calls from supported software on your computer, such as Microsoft Teams, Zoom, or Google Meet. And if your smartphone is paired up to the Logidock, you can even answer and end phone calls from your smartphone. And there's a Kensington lock port, so in case you don't want your Logidock to go missing, you can keep it secure. On the side, there's a USB-C port in case you want quick access for a mouse, a headset, or maybe your phone charger. Setting up the Logidock is simple. You'll download the Logisync software. We'll have a link in the video description below. Then you'll plug in the Logidock to the power outlet in the wall and the other USB-C cable into the computer or the laptop. Computers are getting smaller and faster, and they're removing many of the USB ports. So having a docking station is becoming more and more important. The Logidock is not only a USB docking station, it can also uh, extend to external monitors, but it's even more than that. It's really a device that is designed to help you have more productive and efficient video meetings. Let me explain. It's designed to connect to your Google or Microsoft calendar to remind you of upcoming meetings and join them easier. Once you connect your calendar to the Logisync software, when you have an upcoming meeting, you'll get a notification on your computer and the Logidock will light up with an LED light, letting you know you have a meeting. And if it's a supported application, you can simply press the circle button at the top of the dock to instantly join the meeting. Currently, there's support for Google Meet, Zoom, Microsoft Teams, and a few others. There are five touch sensitive buttons on the top of the dock. These are all designed for you to have a better video meeting experience. So during a video meeting, you can mute or unmute your microphone. You can actually turn on or off your webcam. 
you can increase or decrease the volume, and you can even end the video meeting from the touch of the circle button on the dock. I do like the buttons, they're intuitive, they're easy to use, and they work well, but they're really only designed for video meetings. Oftentimes I'm listening to music or podcasts, and it would be nice if I was able to pause or play music or fast forward or skip tracks through the buttons on the dock itself. So when a meeting comes in, I'll launch it, but unfortunately I have to go search and find the music tab in order to pause the music so it's not continually playing during the meeting. And if you're using a business headset from Logitech, like the Logitech Zone Wireless or the True Zone Wireless earbuds, then you have a feature that allows you to switch the audio between the speakerphone of the Logidoc and the headset. So as soon as you put on the headset, it will switch the audio from the speaker to the headset. And then when you put the headset down or put the buds back in the case, it will switch back to the Logidoc. The Logidoc is a full speaker phone, so it has microphones and speakers built into the dock. But of course, we had to put it up against the test of our laptop to see the sound quality difference of the microphones, and here's how it performed. All right, this is what it sounds like on the laptop in a quiet environment, no background noises going on. This is what it sounds like. All right, this is the Logidoc in a quiet environment. This is what it sounds like with no noise in the background on the Logidoc. And this is office noises going on in the background through the laptop. This is what it sounds like. And this is office noises in the background with the Logidoc. This is what it sounds like. And this is the barking dog sound test with the built-in laptop mic. This is what it sounds like. This is the barking dog sound test on the Logidoc. This is what it sounds like. This is the crying baby sound test through the laptop mic. This is what it sounds like with crying babies in the background. And this is the crying baby sound test on the Logidoc. This is what it sounds like. What are your overall thoughts on the microphone quality on the Logidoc? Drop your thoughts in the comment section below. Curious to hear your feedback. Now the alternative docking stations are the WD series from Dell and the G5 series from HP. And those are a bit less expensive than the Logidoc, but will not have all those features for meetings and won't have that speaker phone. They're priced at about $200 and $250. And the Logidoc is MSRP price is $399, but it's available right now on our website, headsetadvisor.com for much less than that. So go check it out. And if you wanna save even more, make sure you use coupon code YouTube, all one word, YouTube. Now the differences with the HP and Dell docking stations is they have uh, some additional ports like a RJ45 port. So in case you wanna use a wired ethernet cable, you cannot do that with the Logidoc. They'll also have some extra USB ports and possibly an additional display port on the back of the dock. But what they lack is that they don't have a full speakerphone built in. They're not gonna look as great as the Logidoc. And also it's not gonna be designed to be optimized to work with video meetings. So you're not going to miss those important video calls and have a better experience for your work applications. Now an alternative option to consider if you're just looking for some additional USB ports and clearing up the clutter on your desk is the Yealink BH71, which is a Bluetooth wireless headset that allows you to connect to your computer, your smartphone, and also your Yealink desk phones that has three USB-A uh, 3.0 ports on the side of it. So you can connect all your devices into one station and the price is under $250, which is crazy. Overall, the Logidoc is a great looking USB-C docking station that's going to beef up your audio quality, your speakers and your microphones, and allow you to connect all your devices through just one USB-C cable and even charge your laptop if it supports USB-C charging. Now, according to a recent survey, about half of all people on video meetings are either late 
or have poor audio quality. And the Logitech Doc really solves these problems. You'll be reminded of upcoming meetings and be able to join them easier but with that button on the top of the dock. And also you'll have much better audio quality that will make everybody else in the meeting very happy. Again, the Logi Doc will be on our website. The link will be in the video description below. Don't forget that coupon code YouTube. If you want to learn more about the Logitech True Zone wireless earbuds that allows you to automatically switch the audio between the buds and the Logi Dock, and it just makes it a seamless integration and a good experience, then check out this full in-depth review video we did right over here on the True Zone wireless earbuds. That's all we got for you on this video. Thanks a lot for watching, and we'll see you on the next one.